that qualifies as one of the weirdest things I've seen in America. But pretty cool. Oh yeah, it's always fun when you're in a place called Craggy Wash and it starts raining. Let's hope it doesn't rain too much. Take advantage of this free water and wash my solar panels. They're gonna be gross. Wow, it's raining enough to make like drops on my window. It's really raining. The sun came out. It's just drying up everything. Covered in cloud. There's, I guess, a missed rainbow. <laughs> been out here for a few days, I've run out of food, so I gotta go to town. And I don't understand it, but I guess Lake Havasu has the London Bridge, like the actual London Bridge. I took it apart, moved it across the ocean, and now it lives in Arizona. So let's go see the London Bridge. It qualifies as one of the weirdest things I've seen in America. But pretty cool. It's the London Bridge. Let's walk across. In 1968, a land developer named Robert McCulloch purchased the London Bridge for two and a half million dollars and arranged for a ship to bring the external granite bricks to the desert of Arizona with intentions on it being a tourist attraction. You can see where they've taken everything apart. Legit. It's the cracks from where they split it and moved it. Reconstruction took three years and another four and a half million dollars, placing a man made canal under the bridge. Yup. A real London Bridge in America. There it is. The London Bridge in Arizona. Just something intriguing about a London Bridge with palm trees. This has got to be the most interesting piece of Arizona I've seen. I'm just... I don't know whether I'm confused or not. <laughs> 